Hello everybody, I'm joined by Charlie Laylor and uh, he is working in the City Beach area and I've got a couple of questions I wanted to ask uh, Charlie to introduce you to Charlie. So Charlie, uh, why real estate? What do you like about it? Well, real estate's um, very challenging. Um, that appeals to my competitive side. It's also uh, very stimulating. Um, no two days are the same and you're always meeting lots of new people. Um, selling a home is a big decision, as you know. Um, whether that's the family home or an investment property and it's a real privilege to be entrusted with that yeah. decision by your clients. So that brings me uh, uh, some of the challenges and some of the joys that I've taken in the, my real estate career. Absolutely. Biggest investment decision people will, will make yeah. and uh, it is good that we're entrusted with that decision. So. Uh, now you're working in the City Beach area and surrounds, I am. so why did you choose City Beach? I have a particular attachment to City Beach. I've lived in the wider area for the last 25 years and um, my three girls have all attended the uh, City Beach Surf Club Nippers program. I've yes. spent many a Sunday morning on the beach and travelled the, travelled the country on, uh, on uh, tours with the uh, team. My daughter has represented the state. The beach itself is beautiful. Uh, the surf club and the new restaurants have really invigorated that foreshore and uh, there's a real buzz about the place. Yeah, it is beautiful and that might be why you uh, partake one of your hobbies that we'll get to later on. I can see the background now. Um, and uh, why should our clients trust you and Dave Real Estate with their property? I have a deep understanding of property and I love a property. I've been in the building industry for almost 15 years. Um, during that time, I've assisted hundreds of clients achieve their dream of owning yeah. their own home. Um, on a personal level, I've actually built and sold more than a dozen homes. Yeah, I yes, I have. And, uh, it gives you a first-hand experience of the real estate up close. Yeah. Um, I feel I can draw on my personal and my business experience and bring a fresh energy yeah. um, and enthusiasm and deliver a first-class sales experience to my clients. Yeah, maximize their results yeah. with all the experience I've mentioned. Uh, now, the mirror ball, not the mirror ball, the uh, magic ball, the crystal ball the crystal ball. What do you think is going to happen in the city beach area and northern suburbs in general in the next three to six months as far as real estate goes? Well, the northern coastal suburbs have always commanded the premium price yep. um, compared to the broader market and that, that's just a reflection of the attraction of coastal living. Um, what the, but the market property market in the months leading up to COVID a year ago, we're actually showing signs of improvement. Um, so I think what we're seeing now is the re-emergence of a market that's now pent up and releasing that pent up demand. So I think there are a number of factors that are going to sustain that market. Demand is very strong and uh, the supply of listings is yeah. down 30% yeah. on a year ago, um, down 50% on two years ago. So uh, interest rates are low, so money is cheap to borrow. Yeah. And, uh, the Reserve Bank has flagged that interest rates are likely to remain low for some time to come. I think they have an inflation target of 2 to 3% before yes. uh, rates will rise, and that's not likely to happen on their estimates before 2024. So property is cheap. Our property is cheap. It's cheap by comparison to the eastern states. Yeah. Uh, we're trading at about 500,000 for our median value. Yeah. Um, I think Sydney, New South Wales is about 975 nine nines. So uh, our economy is strong yeah. and confidence remains very high. So COVID unfortunately and tragically continues to ravage across the world and that has restricted travel, international travel, and it's likely to do so for some years to come. So I think it's likely that um, WA is, is seen to be a safe haven. Yeah. Good jobs, yeah. strong economy, and an enviable lifestyle. So I think these factors combined will, will underpin strong price growth for the years to come. Yeah. Absolutely. So not just next three to six, you're thinking we're going to get some good growth for the years well, ahead. We've had, uh, we've had from the peak of the mining boom in 2016, we had four years of almost no growth. Yeah. So uh, our market runs counter cyclically generally to the eastern states. So it's it's our turn. Yeah. And I think the pent up demand and the the uh, COVID factors will underpin our market for some time to come. Yeah, absolutely. Well, like you, I've got over 20 years in the real estate industry, and uh, I agree with you entirely. So. Uh, now, when you're not doing real estate, which is not often, let's be honest, what do you do? Well, when I'm not doing it, I try and, um, my, uh, my main hobby, because my girls are all swimmers. One's a rotten swimmer, and uh, two of the others are, are lap swimmers, or, or uh, competitive swimmers. 
Um, I try and keep up with them, but I stopped doing that a long time ago. So I, I just punch out for Lapstan at Bold Park Pool, which is my local pool. And uh, in summer, when the weather reaches more, uh, more uh, pleasant temperatures, I'll do groin to groin down the pool. But I have cycled for many years, and uh, I do like to get out and uh, do get out on, on my bike. Yeah. And uh, yoga is a, is a recent um, passion of mine, so uh, yeah. I find that's very calming. Yeah. Um, so. Um, Right, that fits in the spare time. Yeah, lovely. Well, that's Charlie Lalo, or uh, where can people meet you, Charlie? Um, well, I'm based at the Scarborough office, but I'm mobile and I'm easily accessible via my mobile and uh, through you know, LinkedIn, Facebook, and I'm also on Instagram. Yeah, or come and visit you at Real Estate Scarborough. I'll share you a coffee. See you there. Thank Bye. you.